It's the magic of math here, and today we're going to graph a proportional relationship where we determine some ordered pairs that represent the situation and graph them on a coordinate plane. Here's our question today. We're told that pens cost $1.50 each at a school store. We're asked to graph a line that represents Y, the cost in dollars, of purchasing X pens at the store. Here's where I'd like you to pause the video. Select your points and line on this graph and then come back to see mine. Good luck. Welcome back. We're graphing a line and we know that Y is the cost of dollars of purchasing X pens. So we're going to use that information and we're going to write ordered pairs where X represents the number of pens I purchase and Y is the total amount I spent at the school store purchasing that number of pens. We're told that each pen is $1.50. Let's understand that if I buy zero pens, I'm spending zero dollars at the school store. Let's plot that point. Zero, zero is our origin. Our next one, I'm gonna pick two pens to purchase. If I buy two pens and they're each $1.50, $1.50 times two, or added to itself, is $3. So two pens up to $3 place my ordered pair. And now because I have two points, I can connect my line. I always plot a third just to check my work. So let's look if I buy one pen. One pen would cost me $1.50. One pen, halfway between one and two for $1.50, and I plot my point, and it's on my line. So that's my safety net. That's my check. And I can see that if I spend $1.50, one pen, and each time I add another $1.50, I get another pen. $1.50, another pen, $1.50, another pen. So I can see that if I spend $6 in the school store, I purchased four pens. And there you have it. That is how you graph a proportional relationship in a coordinate plane. Thanks for joining me today at The Magic of Math, where we continue to master math one video at a time. Thanks for joining me today, and I hope you'll come back soon.